Today, we have three chefs, one stomach, and a huge cash prize. Rules are simple. You have 90 minutes to make the most delicious food I've ever tasted in my life. Whoever can make the best dish wins the first ever Avery B cooking competition. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I brought you all here today because I'm hungry. And we're about to be testing you guys' culinary skills. Are you ready? No. Yes. <laughs> well, no. Yeah. So, I'm going to grade you on a multiple, various variety of facets. Number one being presentation. Number two being taste. And number three being what the fuck you cook, because I heard what you cook. And I don't, <laughs> no, I, I don't. But it's okay. I'm Cash prize, you said. Cash prize. I don't, I don't know how to cook. But today I'm finna try to, yeah, make some shit shake. Today, man, we're about to be cooking for a cash prize. I'm not telling y'all how much it is unless you win. But what I will tell you is we're going to the store and I got each one of you an envelope that contains your budget for the store. By the way, I'm allergic to shellfish and seafood and dairy. So if you get some of that, you automatically out this motherfucker. Like mm -hmm. you eliminate it. I, I, I ain't trying to die. Test. Nah, mm -mm. it's just me. All right, let's head to the store, man. Let's get it. Hey y'all, it's Chef Boardy. <laughs> I'm just playing, y'all. What's up? It's Naya Rican. Y'all seen me before on their little channel for like that. <sighs> my favorite dish to cook, um, I like macaroni and lamb chops, but my boy said he don't eat no dairy. He don't fuck with the cows and shit. So I had to do like something different. and. I'm gonna do something different. Hi guys, my name is Rebaya. I am Rebaya Knight underscore on Instagram and Missy Bree on all platforms. Um, I think I make some mean stuffed salmon, lobster tails, asparagus, broccoli, and mashed potatoes. I just need some quick and easy. I just need an idea. Chicken, chicken. I don't know how to make chicken. I don't have a favorite dish to cook because I don't be in the kitchen. I don't know how to cook. Golden, what the hell is this? <laughs> Just vibe, okay, get out of my okay. cart. Bro, okay, I gave him I, options, bro. You got beef for chicken, bro. Noodles is crazy, bro. So um, she definitely gonna get eliminated. I'm going out every hour to see what I need. I'm not gonna lie. Avery set these girls up. Like I'm in there keep, keep, keep laughing and shit. Like, girl, you got this shit. They ain't gotta reach anything. I really do cook, for real, so. That's how I feel about it. Sorry, y'all. When I first moved to Vegas, y'all, I was trying to make some baked spaghetti at that. I was trying to make some baked spaghetti and the stove, the whole stove caught on fire, but it didn't catch on fire because I was that bad at cooking. It actually was some plastic bags at the bottom of the stove and we didn't know that, so it set the kitchen on fire. Um, you know, I was a little shooken, but then um, I overheard somebody say like, they don't know how to cook. I ain't even gonna lie, I think I got my foot in the door. I might fuck around and do some ramen noodles with boiled eggs. Ooh, that's real fancy. Oh God, that's fancy. Some ramen noodles with boiled eggs and some shrimp. Oh, we, we doing it big today. All right, man, so we are finally back from the store. As you can see from in front of me, the ladies have set up shop, set up their stations. Gonna come here first. What you got going on? Let me know some. All right, so I got some honey cornbread made with almond milk, because my boy don't eat dairy at all. I got some uh, chicken fried rice. I got some lamb chops made the Jamaican way. I don't know what to call it. I got some broccoli. I'm gonna steam it, put in some garlic butter. And I got some, um, oh, that's it. Dang. Hello. That's it. Okay, hold on, you missed some. Oh, a uh, little margarita. A little margarita. <laughs> so I can feel like myself. You know, y'all be sexy as hell cooking in the kitchen. Okay. That's how you do it, Paul. Okay, smooth. Let's move on to the next contestant, man. I see a pineapple. <sighs> you Let know. me know some. So like I said, like I'm a real deal chef. Mm -hmm. So like we're gonna do a pineapple bowl. And you know, yellow rice really gives more flavoring. So we're gonna use yellow rice. And we have like three different meats over here. But y'all gonna see how I'm gonna include that in the pineapple. And then, you know, you can't never go wrong with a Hawaiian butter bread on the side. Okay. And some broccoli. Cause um, you said you like broccoli. I love broccoli. Yeah. Okay, chef. All right, so boom, this is what we got. We got some noodles. Yeah, then we're gonna sauce it up with some chicken. It's chicken noodles. Then we're gonna, you know, plate it real nicely so it can look like we doing something, but we on a budget low key. And then we're gonna do some eggs too, some boiled eggs, you know, put it on the plate, make it look real good. Got my little seasoning over here. Not too much, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Why didn't you spend the rest of the money? <laughs> Cause I, I, I thought we was, I thought you said um, $30. I thought you said don't use the whole 50. Sorry. I wish you would've used the <laughs> We went down the line, seeing all of the chef's dishes. Now chefs, you have 90 minutes to cook your dish. Good luck. Damn, ain't no 
flavor 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 I'm opening up my pineapple. Everybody wanted to know what my pineapple was for. Yeah. So I gotta cut the insides of it out, but we're not gonna waste no pineapple. No, no, no. And cut a little square in there so we can get all of that out and make it a bowl. I'm just opening up my seasonings, you know, wasting some time while they. And what exactly are you about to season? My chicken. You don't see this plain chicken here? Yeah, you can use this so, yeah, what's this for? This is the noodles, and it got the season for the noodles, but it's in this chicken flavor. So, you got to add the chicken. The, I'm going to slice the chickens on top real nicely. Like, just watch. Golden, I, I love her. You see this? I love you. But noodles and eggs and chicken, because you got chicken flavored noodles. Come on, come on. I told you to do some spaghetti. I told you to do spaghetti. Noodles. You pop them in the microwave. Put a little seasoning on it. Like, everybody even had it. So noodles, don't really want no noodles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? Use some of the lemon. Use some of the, yeah, and then just, no, no, just, you know, bite. And, and. I'm just squeezing it. Yeah, it, yeah. It's, It's really, yeah, uh, cooking it up in here. Um, I ain't even gonna lie. I feel like I got this in the bag now. Next, I'm gonna put some uh, Jamaican one stop sauce in my uh, lamb chops because that's tea. Food come along great. Um, like I said, Rabia, I don't know her shit looking like I'm gonna have to goddamn put the oxtail inside the cornbread and put the cornbread on top of the right. You see what I'm saying? I'm gonna have to really freak the presentation because her shit got a pineapple. Bitch, well, who? Alright, I'm I'm be better. Well, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. shit smelling really good though. Is it her? It might be my hot taco. I gave her a little. Damn. That's what I'm saying, bro. How you coming along? Let me see how you coming along. It's you? Okay. That's perfect though. It's season. But, but yeah, but I got the chicken real decorative, real nice. Like she cubed up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not too much, not too late. <laughs> Simple. Okay. When you gonna cook it? Oh, um, probably when she get like halfway done, cause she got a lot more than me. I want my stuff to be warm. Yeah. Smart, smart strategy. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, she got the butter in the pineapple. It's looking good. So y'all, I just walked in there. I looked at everybody dish. Honestly, bro, Naya Rican, bro, smelling so good. Like I seen her lamb chops, bro, and I'm like, oh my gosh, that shit smells so good. Rabia pineapple looks so fucking good too, bro. She got like cute butter in her pineapple. That shit looks amazing. Golden, she's coming along. She's coming along better than I thought. I know how cooking supposed to look, and that's like the pre-stages of how it's supposed to look. She ain't got to the intermediate or like where it's supposed to be, so hopefully she can move it along. She got some two well-rounded cookers next to her, so hopefully, Hopefully she can get right, man. I'm ready to judge these plates. I'm ready to eat. I'm hungry. Y'all doing too good over there. I'm scared. I'm losing. Whoever win though, can I get like $5 to go get me a Happy Meal? What you doing with that? You put it in the bowl? Oh, yeah. On top of the rice. So you gonna put like a sauce on it so like it looks like creamy and shit? This is the most friendliest competition I ever had to be in. Like, I don't even want to talk shit no more, y'all. <laughs> they cool as fuck. What with them? <laughs> so y'all last saw me, I was just wasting time, but I actually got in there and I started cooking up some stuff. So I, what I did was y'all, I actually got a little help. Not too much help, I just got a few tips, but I went and I looked, I did his chicken real, real nice. So it looked like really decorative. Bro, my plate is finna be plated. You hear me? Plated. Like I'm really finna cook this shit up. Honestly, um, nah, her, her, her stuff smelling good already y'all. So I, I'm already knowing I'm finna lose. So at this point, I feel like I'm just having fun and I'm learning as I'm watching them cook. She got some lambs. The lambs is well seasoned. She is smelling good while it's on the stove. Rabaya got seasoned pineapples. Her pineapples are seasoned. What? Never in my life ever, ever, ever saw no seasoned pineapples. Seasoned what? Some seasoned pineapples. Who? Some seasoned pineapples. I'ma stay focused. I'ma stop focusing on their food. Cause that's what I'm doing a lot. I'm doing a lot of focusing on what they got going on and not a lot on me. I gotta put more love into what I got going on. So that's what we really finna do. We finna put more love into what I got going on and then y'all just gonna see the outcome.
It is finally decision time. I finally see all three dishes for the first time. I'm hungry as fuck. Like I'm literally starving right now, bro. So I hope they came with some pressure. I hope they came with some fire. It's smelling very good in this kitchen. To my knowledge, everybody is backstage right now with their dish. You can bring them out one by one, man. How's it going? Good. What do we have here? Um, right here we have a pineapple bowl, sauteed pineapple bowl. We have chicken, steak, and sausage with sauteed lemon on the side, broccoli, and honey butter bread. What inspired the dish? Um, I just like cute meals. And cute honestly. meals. Did you taste it? I, I did. Oh, was it, was it good? It was good. Why are you looking away? Because you taste, you know, like the broccoli. You don't like your broccoli? I didn't say that. This is the chicken? Mm-hmm. This is the steak? Mm-hmm. This is rice? Mm-hmm. Mm. I definitely um taste like the tropicalness mm -hmm. in the rice. What you put on the bread? Honey and butter. Mm -hmm. I like that. You did good. Thank you. As far as um the pineapple presentation, nice. I love that it's served out of a pineapple. I love that you um even saute the lemon. That's very good details, attention to details. This like is mind blowing for my palate right now. This is definitely, definitely a lot of flavors going on here, you know. Not bad. Ready for the next dish. How you doing? Hello. Can you talk to me what's going on here. So we got some chicken fried rice with broccoli, with some um, smoked Jamaican lamb chops and cornbread and garnish for your rice. Okay. Love the presentation, by the way. Thank you. You went to culinary school? I did it from the hood. From the hood. Carrots. Pretty good. You got some broccoli. Did you taste your dish? I you didn't. Wow, why not? I don't know. What type of seasoning you use on the broccoli? Uh, lemon pepper and Old Bay. Amazing. That rice is really good. What type of rice is this? It's chicken fried rice. I love cornbread and yeah. bread. Mm -hmm. Good motherfucker, him. Talk to you later. All right. <laughs> this and the, you know, I don't know which one I like the most, bro. I don't, I don't, this, this ain't good. It's too, it's too salty. On to the third and final dish. I came to win, to fly, to prosper. Here you go. Explain what you got here. So I got here some noodles, some chicken, chicken noodles at that, with the chicken, and some eggs, some boiled eggs. Real cute and simple. Okay. Straight to the point. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to cook nothing else, so I really put my all into that. Like, yeah. Chicken done? It should be. <laughs> I mean, to, I tested it, I tried it. It so should I'm, be. I'm still alive, I'm still it alive. Should. So she good, she look it. Yeah. You didn't even eat it right. You supposed to like eat it all together in one. Like, you see me? I want to take the individuals real quick, you know what I'm saying? All right, say that. Okay, wait, before you eat that though, I kind of forgot that the noodles was on the stove for a little minute, but all right, go ahead, finish. You got a lot of, you got a lot of if, ands, buts, nah, what right, if. you right, all right, go ahead, good. You confident uh, in this dish, chef? I'm confident. Eat. Yeah, that's that shit. That's that shit. I'm telling you, that shit good as fuck, Amo. See, no, 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 no. You can't eat, just eat that by itself. You gotta, like, dip the juice in it or something. Like, what is you doing? 
Like that. Yeah, like you eating it wrong, so I don't even know. Yeah, you like, gotta put some sauce on in this shit like that. Yeah. Wow. Straight like that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Get the fuck out. Get <laughs> the fuck out. All right, can I have all three dishes, please, chefs? Talking about nothing. Y'all playing talking about nothing. What are you saying? Stop playing about food. Yeah. Speechless. Look at all these. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to talk with my mouth dry as shit. Oh, I forgot oh, the drink. Exactly. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Mix it up. 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 You okay. like strawberries or apples? Don't even matter. Oh, this bitch is dry too. Yeah. I just feel like this can help you drink out shit anyway, so. So we got water right here. Mmm. Mm -hmm, that's the best one. <laughs> Hello. A little water, H2O and shit. Ice cold. Ice. I'm gonna eliminate one dish at a time. If your dish is on the chopping block, can you please, um, you know, just get it out of the way? <laughs> yeah, you can take this one. Damn, me first? You can, leave, you can leave it there. You sure you took my plate? Only reason, I'm gonna tell you why. Only reason I'm getting rid of your plate is because like, I didn't had that meal probably like a million times in my life. Right. Right. Boiled eggs, ramen noodles. You ain't never had chicken with it though. Like, I really, yeah. Ladies, last two. Chef Rabaya, Chef Rican. Thank you for participating today. I wanna share a couple of stats that I've gathered. Number one. It's presentation. I graded you guys on presentation. I'm gonna start with you, Rabia. So your presentation, I see that you had a pineapple. The fact that you had a pineapple is crazy. You know, you went over the top. I like that, you know? So for presentation, I gave you a score. Out of 10 possible points, I gave you a 10. 10 out of 10 for presentation. Ms. Rican. Um, For your dish, presentation-wise, you really can't see now, I kind of fucked it up. But it was a bed of rice, and on top, two lamb chops crossed over each other. On the side was great color, also this beautiful piece of cornbread. I gave you a score out of 10 points, a 10 as well. I'm sad to say, on the taste, you did not get the same. Somebody got higher and somebody got lower. Ms. Rabia, out of 10 possible points, I gave you an eight for the taste. Great. Okay. You know, it's great. I would like for you to step forward. Because Ms. Nairican got a 8.5. Which makes her the winner of today's competition. <laughs> this is your envelope. It contains $1 million. 360 deal. I got a new full set and some toes. Hello, thank you. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video, cause I enjoyed it, my stomach enjoyed it. So, me personally, I feel like Maya food was good. I tasted it and she worked really hard on it and y'all, she went crazy trying to do it. So I definitely want to speak my pride with my food. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's been another video on Every Beast channel. I think this was a successful one. My stomach's happy. I think they're all happy. Hopefully you're happy. What are we doing? What's the move? Drink some more margaritas. <laughs> this dish was amazing. I enjoyed it. So, who won? Um, they both won. What? They split the prize money. Mm. Mm. What? Well, I won. Well, if it was the first, second, third place, if we were doing that, then. <laughs> I came with third. You did come with third, so since you came with third, it's a dollar for you. Thank you, that's more than a dollar. See, there we go, one, there we go. Now we talking, appreciate it. He did say he had ham for Thanksgiving, ain't him? He said he had ham for Thanksgiving. Is this ham? Oh God. <laughs> this rose. I'm allergic to cheese and shellfish. So if a girl coming here with cheese, I'm calling my security personally, you feel me? Hopefully they wash their hands. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna be hey, make sure she make sure she wash her hands, twin. You dead ass, bro. I don't wanna eat no crazy. Cause you eating it too, nigga.
I, you eating it too? I'm gonna make all y'all niggas eat it. I'm making my whole production team eat this shit with me, nigga. We not alone, man. Yeah, see, I knew you knew how to do yeah. something. You ain't never had chicken with it, though. Like, I really, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I showed up and I showed out. Like, alright, appreciate it.